Friday morning, roughly 100 miles west of Point Loma, 25 individuals were rescued by the U.S. Coast Guard after being notified by a Good Samaritan. New at 6, we speak with that Good Samaritan who is a local captain. He tells our ABC 10 News reporter Sofia Hernandez he was just in the right place at the right time. Yeah, Vanessa, that's right. Captain Marcus Medic tells me that he was on day one of a three day fishing trip and on night one when they were catching tunas, when he saw those faint lights in the distance, those 25 passengers asking for help. It was from this dock where Captain Medic and his boat, the new Loan, took off Thursday night. He tells me he was roughly 100 miles west of Point Loma, 25 miles behind San Clemente Island. Had a stop where we caught a few nice fish and right after we wrapped up that stop, there was, I knew there was one other boat in the area with us. So I looked around to see where his lights were. And uh, I could see a real, a couple of real dim lights, not very far away from us. Those lights coming from the 25 passengers aboard this Penga style boat, stranded for three days in rough conditions. I feel really fortunate that we found them when we did. I think one more night, it would have had a tragic ending. The new low land crew giving this boat food and rope, waiting for the Coast Guard to arrive. The U.S. Coast Guard has rescued other capsizes in recent months. In July, eight suspected smugglers from Encinitas. In May, 23 people rescued off a suspected smuggling boat near Sunset Cliffs. While it's not known why this boat was stranded by sea, one captain, just glad he was there. If I'd been on a boat broken down out there in the middle of the ocean, it sure would be nice if uh, somebody bumped into me and then I, uh, so I feel like uh, we've got a little bit of good karma coming our way. Now, Captain Medic says that the U.S. Coast Guard got there swiftly. They worked very complex conditions and were able to rescue everyone safely. Now, Medic was able actually to continue on his fishing journey and they actually took off on another one this afternoon. At Point Loma Sport Fishing Landing, Sophia Hernandez, ABC 10 News. And Sophia, thank you.